In vitro fertilization. The process of in vitro fertilization is divided into different stages. Ovarian stimulation. Hormone medication is administered by means of subcutaneous injections to stimulate the ovaries. The aim is to make the ovaries produce follicles from which the ova are obtained to carry out in vitro fertilization. The treatment begins in the first days of menstruation and lasts between 8 and 11 days. During this time, follicle growth is monitored by echographic examination. When the follicles are a suitable size, ovulation is provoked and ovarian puncture is planned for 36 hours later. Obtaining ova, fertilization and culture of embryos. For the ova to be extracted, the patient must be admitted to the clinic, accompanied and with an empty stomach. Ovarian puncture is carried out in the operating theatre and the patient is anaesthetised throughout the process. The ovaries are punctured by means of vaginal echography so that the liquid contained in the follicles can be extracted for laboratory analysis to find the ova. This procedure takes between 10 and 15 minutes, after which the patient will wake up normally. Two or three hours after the puncture, the patient is released and can return home. She must take relative rest for the remainder of that day. The ova obtained are analysed in the laboratory in order to inseminate them. About four to five hours later, a spermatozoid is injected into each ovum, and the ova are cultured in an incubator to ensure ideal conditions for them to develop. After 18 to 21 hours, it is checked whether the ova are properly fertilised. The resulting embryos are cultured until they reach the blastocyst stage, i.e. an embryo after five days of development. Embryo transfer On the day of the transfer, the woman must decide how many embryos are to be transferred and go to the transfer room close to the laboratory. Embryo transfer is a simple procedure which does not require anaesthetic. A catheter is inserted through the cervical canal and the embryos placed in the uterus. The process is monitored by echography to ensure that the embryos are put in the right place. After transfer, the patient can return home and lead a normal life, avoiding severe physical effort and risk activities. Twelve days after transfer, a pregnancy test can be carried out to confirm whether she is pregnant.